we were introduced to internet in 1996 and like by the end of the last year the connectivity rate i mean the internet penetration rate of mongolia was just over 35 percent so we still have like so many people unconnected and uh, like why it's unconnected is that, like we should look at these uh, three like special cra characteristics of Mongolia like uh, I believe we should address that the first one is Mongolia is a very large country in terms of the territory it's the 18th largest country in the world and uh, also um, like we have 331 Soms which is the smallest districts uh, in Mongolia and uh, the dif uh, distance between each sum is like minimum 30 kilometers and secondly we are like a most sparsely populated country in the world so each of those sums have only like around 900 people or like maximum 10,000 people the thirdly we are more nomadic people so those people who live in that sum they don't actually stay in the same place every year. So they move to not one place another. So the using a fiber optic to connect the Mongolia is almost impossible. Most of the people, like 2.6 million people are connected to internet, but the 91% is using a mobile internet, 3G or 4G connection. One of the challenges that we have to face is like in terms of connecting the rural areas, but we still have like so many people who are actually living in the city but are still not connected to internet. It's like uh, the number is actual number is 1.7 times more people living in the city and not connected to internet than the people living in the rural, rural area. You may ask why? It's because um, we have uh, the people who are living in the nomadic way but is still in the city, especially the outskirts of Ulaanbaatar, which is the capital of Mongolia, and they um, are living in one of the very clustered areas and it's called gear districts and that's very hard to use like uh, fiber optic to connect them because they don't want to move or it's like very clustered so um, one of the biggest challenges that our city is facing today is to connect those people how they how are we going to connect those people in the outskirts of the city so it brings some opportunities to, for the private companies and i believe that private and public partnership in terms of the ICT connectivity is actually quite good. As a, it's my opinion as a citizen, uh, because uh, our government, they support us uh, using more, like a lot of incentives. And also like we have uh, three, four big operator companies in Mongolia, and they are actually quite um, like competing for the customers and they are actually doing quite good. So we, last year, I think one of the companies actually connected every SOMS to each other using a 3G, but uh, then uh, like it's just the center of this SOM, not exactly the whole area. So it's still like there is some problems with that.